Farmers need markets. They need competition, which is fair. So in other words, they don't need to be competing with subsidized products coming from other countries or dealing with tariffs put on their products as they ship abroad. We have the best farmers in the world. We do. They have the ability to feed the world. They need access to markets. One of the things I think the president has done extremely well, even though we had politicians criticizing him for doing it, is say, look, I want to move to a world without tariffs. But to do that, I'm going to threaten use of tariffs on countries that are trying to block American goods or pose tariffs on them or subsidize the production of their goods and give unfair advantages that we don't currently give to our farmers and our manufacturers. So as farmers, what they want, they want to be able to compete. They want to be able to get out there. They want to be able to sell their product to obviously, yes, of course, the people of Wisconsin and the people of our country, but abroad too. And they want to know that when they go into those foreign markets and they bring the best products in the world, that they're going to have the ability to sell without others trying to shackle them and get them out of the marketplace. So that's what we need. We need United States senators that understand that these farmers are business people. They're out there turning out a great product, and they're working really hard to do it with a high risk threshold. What we need to do as the people that represent them is get out there and kick open the doors and the markets that they currently can't compete in. And then say to those that want to sell their products in the United States, hey, you're welcome to but you don't get to give unfair advantages to your producers if you want to come into our markets. That's what our farmers want. They want a fighting chance to get out there and succeed, and I'm going to give them that in the U.S. Senate.